I will fight corruption like Buhari Tenable. Welcome to the news and thank you for tuning in to listen. As the 2023 general elections draw near and with less than seven months to the end of the tenure of the Buhari-led All Progressive Congress government, the All Progressive Congress APC presidential flag bearer, Asiwaju Bola Tenambo, has vowed to continue fighting corruption like President Muhammad Buhari did if elected president in 2023. As reported by Daily Post, Asiwaji made this assurance while unveiling his campaign policy document, document in Abuja on Friday. He said his administration will continue Buhari's civil service reforms to reduce corruption and would ensure the reduction of waste and the civil services if he succeeds Buhari in 2023. Meanwhile, as reported earlier, as reactions continue to trail, the new presidential campaign committee list of the ruling party, the All Progressives Congress, one of the listed members and a social justice peace advocate, Reverend Gideo Paramalam, on Friday said neither he nor his wife, Profumi Paramalam, was aware of the nomination as members of the All Progressives Congress, as their consent was not sought. Now, this issue is, is it has set, um, Social media on fire. And the thing is, Nigerians, Koma says the social media on fire. Oh, this particular news does not reduce the price of groceries in the market. I mean, for goodness sakes, groceries is still expensive. Fuel is still on the high side. Diesel is still on the high side. For goodness sakes, you go carry 50,000 and I go market. 50,000 and I go to do like 10,000. Nobody is saying anything. So this issue, it is left for we now. On election day, now we will clear these people. It is not everything that these people do that we need to react to. I'm telling you, I've even told the people that if we start keeping this people quiet, whether they do well, whether they don't do well, uh -huh, at the end of the day, on election day, you go share clear for the eyes. That is why my two cents to you, that is why my two cents to you will be Nigerians. Do not vote along the side of, con uh, of uh, sentiment. Don't be sentimental. Don't allow nepotism, favoritism to be cloud you or religious bigotry to be cloud your sense of reasoning. Ah, now my friend do. Ah, now my grandfather, now my grandfather, great grandfather, distant cousin, a uh, brother. So I will vote for him. No. Ah, that time he helped me well, well, oh. Now Nigeria, now we, we, we Nigeria, we need help too. Everybody needs help, Shogo. So vote wisely and take back your country. Do not even make noise. Even on the polls, I've even told the people, I've given you people the info. I don't give an update. Nobody goes and do anything for a more. You understand? On election day, it's not even the day you can vast. You understand? Especially when you know, say, you're polling, but except you know that, oh, I am, uh, let's say, for instance, I'm a PDP member, and people, PDP people there for this polling, but uh, hey, and I feel come outside, just, hey, eh? but now the gist, now it's good, they very, very open, while making that they know, they clear of it, they happen. If you are an APC member, eh, you are there, you understand? Whatever, you are a Labour Party member, make sure. You are not uh, that day. You know they go argue. Ah, your your person no day okay. He day okay. He sick. He no sick. He did this one. You know mm -mm. that day is for going to cast your vote. He's not even going to converse. He's not going to win anybody over that particular day. Hmm? Now let's look at the part where he said Sinobu said he's going to be fighting corruption like Buhari. I laughed in Spanish. show. <laughs> immediately I read that my laugh in Spanish. I almost laughs my my heart out. I am telling you people. Buhari way under his tenure, they stole more than 100 billion, the account general of the Federation, the AGF. As in that man that married a 16-year-old girl, was it not last year or last two years? And they tell you, that 62, I believe, three years old man, he stole right under their noses more than 100 billion naira. And the latest I'm hearing about is that they gave him a bill to pay, it's not 109 billion, I'd be 120 billion, I'd be 129 billion, nine they say make him pay. And I'm like, what? Hey, <laughs> I'm sorry, yo, with this attitude, though, that is not fighting corruption. Eh? Let me give you people a scenario. Let's say, for instance, you go to a place, you saw somebody steal money, that money that the person stole, let's say, be ten thousand dollars. You understand me? They can't catch the person, they can't charge the person to court. You want the person can't hire a lawyer. And the case is on. And at the end of the day, they can't find this okay, the day guilty, but you want you go pay bail of five thousand dollars. Like I don't get. I mean me get here. 
So the remaining five thousand I don't dash me because me I don't understand you. I don't understand this matter. I know clear. You know clear for me. So Buhari that under his watch a lot was stolen. Was it not this corruption, this anti-corruption? I make people a whole lot of people voted the People Democratic Party out. 2014, 2015, I mean 2015. Naina, the corruption of the, of, the, of the People Democratic Party was what made Nigerians to vote for the and this um, insecurity issue that time, not even knowing that the grandfather, no, sorry, the ancestor of all insecurities, still they come for back. I am telling you. So, Tunubu coming out to tell us, uh, I will vote, uh, uh, I mean, I will fight in corruption sincerely, like Buhari, he's like, ah, Telling us that Shubon, Kolesheko-Kon, that is what I'm hearing. Okay. If Tenubu says they will fight corruption like we heard, that means Tenubu has nothing to offer. Exactly. She to get to me. Uh -huh. Let it not be that I'm speaking plenty, plenty English here. Yeah. People are not understanding me. Because that is it. Do you know the amount they are borrowing to root? Are you aware? The ones where they hear, and they don't tell us so. I they tell you. The ones where we know they hear still do. You see the sitting finance minister? Ah, oh my. That woman. <laughs> Problem. Problem goes cut everywhere. If we get the next president, if the next president is somebody who wants to hold them accountable, who won't press, as in, you know, when you take something, eh, you won't swallow, maybe you take what's in the beyond, you press your neck like it's presser. Make you drink what's in, you could take what's in the beyond, you vomit out, except. If you have somebody who won't press their neck like that, do you know how many they go press that? <laughs> okay, well, no problem. I said, they use their hand, they shoot himself for Lego. I don't know where he may we never shoot himself, so. His supporters are not commenting, greedy bunch of corrupt people with no empathy for the country. In fact, some Nigerians' mentality when it comes to discernment is really frustrating. Maybe I need to bewitch many Nigerians just to see clearly that the All Progressives Congress has no good thing to offer hands, vote them out. My dear, if at this point you are living in this Nigeria, you're not living in Pluto, Nigeria, you're not living in Indonesia, Nigeria, you're not living in Mass, Nigeria, or USA, Nigeria, I did tell you, and you have not seen that there is absolutely something wrong with this government, I tell you, then problem deal. He said that we take you to a, we say a copy the do I, optician, making, making check you well, or we go carry go psychiatrists, make them, make them, make them evaluate you well. Make them, they organize, waiting with the re waiting they do you, go, 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 go. Because I'm telling you, even the baby that is in the womb, you know, say something is wrong. And this government is not good for us. All right, in this note, we have come to the.